Well, everyone, it's Shane Conto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review the new crime thriller, Righteous Thieves, and this is about a head of a secret organization assembles a crew to steal back artwork plundered by Nazis during World War II, and this film is from Anthony Nardolillo, who is our director, Mike, written by Michael Corcoran, and focuses on Lisa Vidal's Annabelle, who is the one working for the secret organization, who kind of runs this crew and brings together Carlos Miranda's Eddie, uh, Jana Lee Ortiz's Lucille, Cam Gigandet's Bruno, and this is, this is a interesting film because, you know, it's very by the numbers set up and everything for like a heist. It actually has shocking amount in common with like the Italian job and I haven't seen the original Italian job I mean like the American remake of Italian job so like it hits a lot of those beats in terms of like hey it's a heist film it assembles the team the whole team I think has some interesting personalities and I think the performers do a good job I enjoyed watching them on screen together and you know you have like the wild car with Bruno who's like can we trust them? We have Annabelle, who's the leader of this crew, who even gets herself a little too personal in this particular heist that might cause them some tensions and issues moving forward. It has some good thrills and suspense from direct from the director's efforts along the way during the heist. And I think what really anchors this and elevates this a bit is that it has meaning. It has the scope of, like really trying to bring the art back from the Nazis and who stole it and trying to give it back to, like, the world and us being able to have that. I think that really works, and I think it's a meaningful message behind the film that adds some layers to it. I think the characters are a fun group of characters that have some good interactions. I buy in to, you know, Eddie and Lucille's kind of backstory that you could definitely tell that there's something there. I believe in Annabelle's mission and what's driving her and it even drives her to make some bad decisions too. These aren't perfect. These characters aren't written to be perfect. They have their flaws. They're interesting. And like I said, you have this wild card Bruno who you're not quite sure where he's coming from and what he's going to do next. And in general, some interesting characters, some solid strong performances, and some deeper meaning behind this helps make this a rock-solid heist thriller that I think is worth your time. It's not a big commitment. It's an enjoyable watch, and I enjoyed it from start to finish, and the pacing, it's good. It doesn't feel over long. It doesn't feel dragged out. It hits the beats that it needs to, moves on, gets us invested, and takes us for a thrill ride. But those are my thoughts. On Righteous Thieves, let me know what you think and let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.